uh, the, the main question is who's going to pay the price for change. Um, so when there's a need for new skills, which is, you know, the speed of change is so quick, of course, there is also the changing need for skills, changing need for different kinds of jobs, uh, you know, uh, declining sectors, increase, uh, you know, newly born sectors, so there's this kind of speed, also a technological change. In that context, to be in an emerging, again, I'm going to exemplify it in, in, in the context of Turkey, uh, in that context, with that speed of change, uh, you have, uh, uh, when you have a dual economy where there is an informal part of the economy, it's very, very difficult to come up with uh, policy devices that, uh, uh, whose actually uh, impact you can measure properly, let me put it that way. Skills is one aspect. Uh, the uh, other aspect is to match the needs of the labor market with the training and education needs of the, uh, uh, of the labor force. Um, so it is, uh, in fact, the government is, has been working on a national employment strategy that will address all these elements uh, separately, also connecting the, uh, the social protection measures with uh, employment policies, uh, which, in fact, uh, another way of saying, you know, uh, activation measures and, and passive measures, you know, connecting the dots. Uh, plus, you know, how you can actually uh, develop, uh, develop a policy uh, of a more job-friendly uh, uh, economic growth. You know what I